Charles, isn't Mr. Sheffield a doll for going to all the trouble and inviting my mother here for dinner? Yes, he's really knocked himself out. <laughs> Did you stock the bar? Yes, Miss Fine. We have Shivers, Pim, Stolichnaya. What does Sylvia like to drink? Diet Slice. Oh, uh, will Fresca do? No, it doesn't have the zest of Lyman. <laughs> Hi. Now I'm gonna have to go out. Hi. Oh, Miss Fine. Well, this should be an interesting dinner, sir. Miss Fine and her mother not speaking, Miss Margaret not speaking to you. That will leave the bulk of the conversation to you and Sylvia. Oh, good God. <laughs> well, perhaps you can swap stories. You can tell her how you started in the theater, and she can tell you how she removes unwanted hair. <laughs> for heaven's sakes, we've got to get someone else for dinner. Well, it is Saturday night, sir. Most people do have a life. Well, I'm off. <laughs> <laughs> Cece, by any chance, are you free tonight? No, I have to pick up my grandfather from the airport. Old thing's in a wheelchair with a respirator on. Why? Well, I was just wondering if you'd care to join me for dinner. Done! Love to! What about, your, what about your grandfather? Oh, he'll get a skycap. He's loaded. He'll put a 20 in his mouth and wave it. No, no, I just can't do no, this. No, my Maxwell, it's not a problem. The old guy's in a wheelchair. It's downhill from LaGuardia. No. You see, it won't be just us. I'm afraid Miss Fine and her mother will be there. Oh, God, I hate that woman. Which one? Pick. <laughs> really, Sylvia's always saying, what a beautiful, charming, sophisticated woman of the world you are. Really? Those are her exact words? Oh, that reminds me. I have to get the name of your manicurist. Sylvia's always going on about how beautiful and young your hands look. I've always adored Syl. But if you have a more pressing engagement... Forget about Gramps. I'll... I'll call the airline, they'll stick him where they put the skis. <laughs> Niles, another place sitting on the table, and make it right next to my pal Syl. Get the name of your manicurist indeed. I learned from the master. Oh, well. <laughs> Aren't my hamsters cute? We named the babies Maggie, Brighton, and Grace. There was a CC, but Miss Fine ate her. <laughs> Isn't that adorable? The kid collects vermin. Sil? Is that you? Yeah, I was invited. <laughs> Shame on you, girlfriend. <laughs> Why haven't we done lunch? Of course, when you saw me eat a chicken, you had to take an Advil. <laughs> oh, hi, Ma. What a nice surprise. Gee, I didn't know Mr. Sheffield invited you for dinner. You want a diet slice? No, thanks. It gases me up. <laughs> hi, Cicela. <laughs> oh, this ring is stunning. My aunt gave it to me. Oh, it's a family heirloom. How nice of you not to throw it back in your aunt's face. Ma, would you cut me some slack? Why won't you wear a stinking coat? You watch your tone of voice, young lady. Oh, I'm sorry. I couldn't help it. Not you, Ma. He's talking to Maggie. Maggie does nothing. She's a good daughter. And what am I, Patty Davis? <laughs> Just like when you refuse the mother-daughter caftans that I bought us. Six years old in a turban? That's it. I wash my hands of you. No, no she's getting away. Not